Hey guys, welcome back to Resident Evil. We're gonna go kill the boss. Oh, there's another boss we have to fight actually now that I think about it. Now that I said we have to kill a boss. How many bosses? Are you ready for her? Two. In total? I don't think he was ready for Jill Vol You're Vol still Vol in the mansion? Yeah, man. Uh, we saw sharks a you long You said this ago. wasn't the only place. Yeah, but you missed it because the, 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 that day you decided to skip out on us to play Warframe. I didn't Yeah, skip you didn't even out. play it anymore. You're all like, oh, I really gotta play Warframe with this douchebag. Who's that guy? I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, you played Warframe instead of uh, playing Resident Evil. So you missed out on the other area, but now we're heading to the... Um... Crap. We're heading to the lab. This still doesn't explain why you came back to the mansion. Because we had a key and we needed to explore the rooms. So I know you don't understand what development of game is. You play Call of Duty. I haven't even played that in Fudge and really Forever. Alright. You so got it. Uh... Oh, did I accidentally. <laughs> ah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> hey guys, we'll be right back. Hey, like the hey guys, welcome back. We were having a serious conversation about the economy. <laughs> yeah, and how, uh... Ooh, no. Okay, I'm cutting that out. And, uh, Matthew's not here because he's playing Warframe because he skipped out. <laughs> like, you obviously know that about last episode. All the... <laughs> Matthew, shut up. <laughs> the chances are that Man, happening. Barry left me a first aid spray that I don't need. Matthew, you'd be like, uh, I'm gonna play Dungeon Defenders 2. We'll play Dungeons and Dragons. Play Dungeon Offenders, too. I'm gonna go in the basement and go play Dungeons and Dragons by myself. Dude, I'd play some Dungeons and Dragons right now. I know, I just need to make better <laughs> stories. Oh my gosh. I actually need to work on it, is the problem. That'd be pretty cool. I was too busy to work on it, though. Especially today, I can't work on it today, actually. You want to edit, and then I'll work on it. I already offered you that one day, and then you're like, "Good offer, but no." Fuck! Fuck! I hate snakes. I'm like Indiana Jones. You have too many episodes. Uh, you have too many episodes at it today for me to even want to do it. I know. That's a problem. It, the problem is, whether people believe oh, it or not... Oh, you're giving them an extra one. It's actually difficult to get a hold of us all at the same time. So, it's... It, well, it is, though. Well, I mean, yeah. not me so much anymore. It's kind of difficult It's kind of difficult for all of us to be, like... That's why sometimes you'll see Matthew, sometimes you'll see Joshua. Why you always see me. Got nothing better to do with my time. Um... No, 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 no. Alright, let's state this now. The reason why Marky's in every episode is because me and Matthew don't record together. We never record together. The only time we record is when Marky is ready to. The is, Matthew and Joshua, didn't you guys try... Is this an intervention? No, 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 it's not an intervention. No, no, no. It's just we, honesty. We tried it. Like, let's be honest. Matthew wouldn't do it. We don't cooperate very often. That's the problem, though. Like, you guys... You guys can't record together because you just you guys just don't get along correctly. I could. And it's too difficult. I could, but it's so boring recording with you again only. Who? You. What do you mean? If me and you only record, it's all like, yeah, we've done this before, but I mean, it'd be nice to record with Matthew. In one wait, wait, wait. For once. That doesn't make sense because that's the most the most like some of our best episodes come from just two of us. Oh, yeah, Whether it be probably, me and you or me and Matthew. All of those because if you notice, people. if you guys seriously notice, if Matthew and Joshua are in a room together, Matthew doesn't talk. Mm. Matthew is quiet in most episodes, and you forget he's even here. But sometimes he'll say something, and he'll be like, oh, okay, good job, Matthew. Now you can go back to being quiet the entire time. But if Matthew and Joshua are by themselves, uh, they argue the entire time. Mm. They recorded... Uh, I believe it was Battle Blog together. Listen, bro. Matthew doesn't like me. And I don't know why. 
technically Matthew's the bad person. Okay, let's be honest. It's not because you don't. It's not because you don't like him, or I he doesn't think, like I think you. It's, I think it's just Matthew has too much respect for me. That he just he just can't. <laughs> oh wow. He can't take it. He just can't take well, it. The problem is you two just don't cooperate correctly. No, no. And you it's argue not too bad. much. It's not I think bad, it is. Then how does it work with me in the room and not you? Just you two. Well, I mean, because to be completely honest with you, I argue with everyone more than you two do. All right, listen, Marky. You're a fudge face, but you're not as fudge face as Matthew. All right, thanks. I appreciate <laughs> that. I don't need that anymore. Uh, and I'm not going to get into this, because this is just a stupid thing to get into in the video. But. He just doesn't like recording with me, I guess. You know, I just think... <laughs> I, I honestly know. think it's because you two don't cooperate correctly. No. Because I, I watched your Battle Block episode. I tried to I tried to record. I was like, it, it, the problem is, I, I was the only one saying anything. And I was like, bro, you need to talk to her in this. I was like, you need to talk to her. And you want to know, that's funny, because he doesn't shut up when he's just with me. And he's really annoying. So it's like, uh, we get a weird trade-off where you you want him to shut up, but when I'm just with him, he doesn't shut up. Well, I mean... Not gonna lie, don't think we're gonna run out of pistol bullets anytime soon. How many... The sad thing is I've shot so many zombies in this game. I think it's because I use the shotgun all the time, though. What just happened? For a second, I thought it was a cutscene. Oh, it is a cutscene. Is that you, Jill? Enrico's? Yeah. You're alive. Stop. Are you with anybody, Jill? No. But why? <laughs> The stars are finished. Someone is a traitor. Umbrella set us up. Enrico! Gee, I wonder who that was. Traitor? Who? Who shot Enrico? Who cares? Enrico's a douche. He's always been a douche. You know what I'm saying? Didn't you know him personally? Yeah, I did. He's a bad guy. She did on his wife. Definitely a professional. Honestly, actually, you know what? I'm Wait. not going to give out murder advice on the channel. Bad idea. I'm not going to give out murder advice on the channel. <laughs> Joshua, that's, 2016. That's something you should I'm not going to teach people how to murder. That's probably a good idea. Oh! Foopy. Oh, oh crap. Oh crap. Let me go, monster. Boom. You need up. You need up. You need up. You gonna get up? No, you're not gonna get up. Alright. One shotgun bullet, seriously? But Acid rounds do wonders for the body. I think I should put. I think I should put the thing back on. I don't know yet. Hold the I'm gonna put the shotgun back on. I have a weird feeling that there's gonna be more hunters. I don't know what it is. Um, I have a feeling because it's a mine. Just saying that now. I know. 
I know there's a key to start the power. It's a key to start the power supply. Oh yeah, but me and, and Matthew can try to record it. Go ahead. Thing together. Please. Mm -hmm. So I don't have to be in everything. Uh, oh guys, it's so difficult being in everything. I'm just kidding. It's not actually that hard. We record video games. Wow, so difficult. I think it's bad. Honestly, I think you guys should. Just for two obvious reasons that I'm going to point out on the channel right now. Um, I don't like certain games, and I refuse to play them. Because I think they're, they'll are they either make bad quality because I'm in them, and I really don't want to play them. And Just things like, like that. You're right. I hated Skyrim. Yeah, it kind of is, though. How many views did Skyrim get? Like two. Mm, not our I'm best. just kidding, I don't know, I didn't pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> well, I could lie to him. And tell him that I care. Not our best. What? Skyrim? <laughs> Alien. Skyrim was okay. Alien was too popular. Because of the one video. Oh. How many views did that get? Like 2,000. Alien has a lot of views. What? Yeah, it has it has like three thousand. <gasps> Two thousand. That is fudging insane. Yeah, I know, but it's embarrassing because we're nothing like that anymore. So like, people are gonna be like, "Oh, well, these these frozen yogurt douchebags are fucking." They weren't what they used to be. Oh. Hey, guess what? People change. <laughs> Fudge. Holy fuck. Uh. Anyway, so we um. Was that too plain? It was too real for me, is the problem. You got too real for a second there. <laughs> well, I mean, it's honest. People are always no. like, they changed. And it's They're embarrassing. They're not as good as they used to be. I'm not going to lie to you. The Alien vs. Robots episode was probably the one of the worst episodes in the series. I'll rewatch it and then take everything I acted like from then. In it was all terrible. We acted all like... I'll act the exact same. I'll talk the exact same. Well, we acted. Well, Matthew can't. We acted Ugh, like thanks. We yeah. acted like idiots, and it was a terrible video. But because of a name, it became <laughs> ex like. I know people are gonna be like, it's not even that popular. It's only got three thousand views. I understand that, but for us, that's a lot. Yeah, all you have to do is call this video "sexy girl yoga," and it will get a lot of a lot of views. Just being honest right now. Barry's not here to save you this time, Jill. Wait, why isn't Wesker dead? Is he still in the mine? Why isn't Wesker dead? <laughs> I mean, he's in the same mine as What he? kind of question is that? Why well, I mean, a giant boulder just rolled past you. And he was kind of spying on you because he's a weirdo. Well, I mean, that's what he does. Can't. <laughs> can't yell at him for that. His personal hobbies. That's like being as on... creepy as they may be. Mm, no, no, man. That's like being all like, oh, he's a he's a good kid. He just he's a little weird. <laughs> That's all. This is the boss. Well, I forgot you existed. No. Oh, there's more. My spider babies. She just pooped on me. Uh. He's supposed to switch to the grenade launcher for this. Something. No, oh, never mind. Oh, great. Fucking poisons. Fucking douchebags. No. I will not take the survival knife. It was such a stupid question. Why? It's crap. This baby spider, like, dude, but it looked so good. Oh wait, Ugh, I forgot. I have to take it. You gotta cut through. Get. Excuse me. Get off the ceiling. Get off the ceiling. Am I almost dead? Uh, there's there's something through this door. I guarantee it. Guarantee it. All right, I'm gonna go through here. Maybe I won't die. Maybe this video will be decent. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, Jill, you can do it. I believe in you. I believe. Okay. Anyway, this survival knife sucks. 
It's not even good. I don't know why I have it. It's like the knife in Resident Evil. Watch, I die as soon as I pick it up. Oh, yes. Did it. I probably should have carried that herb on me, but oh well. Oh, you were poisoned. Leon. Leon. <sighs> Man, people, people complain about Ashley, but she's the best escort mission in any video game. Who's Ashley? Ever. <laughs> Well, uh, if you ever played Resident Evil 4, she's the girl that follows you the entire game. Uh, and whenever she gets captured, she's like, Leon! Leon! But honestly, yeah, she's... Yeah, I remember you she's playing decent, that on our a, Xbox downstairs. She's a decent, uh... She's a decent escort quest. And I hate escort quests. I think they're the dumbest crap. Are you serious? Are you joking right now? Please tell me there's a... Ugh! Hey guys, we'll be back. I'm gonna go get the hexagonal thing. Pretty much every time you said a, yeah, an actual funny joke, I pretty much just laughed. But I don't think there were many of those. Have I ever said something fun? What the fuck? You're too far away. Damn it! It's the wrong one! <laughs> Here's it all. See, I don't even know the commands. Well, I was just using them today. The last time you did, uh, used it was when you made that, that adventure terrible map. adventure map. I mean, it's not. <sighs> you. What adventure? You kind of showed the uh, redstone and uh, stuff. Matthew's the only one that knows how to use redstone. Some, not really. <laughs> I mean. Don't say you're not good at something when you're good with something. I'm not. I don't understand Shut about up. stuff. Everyone's excuse. Oh, fudge. I mean, I'm good with it, but I don't know how to do it. Can we play Earthbound? Yeah, right. I don't know how to use it. So. We were talking about Earthbound earlier, and I really want to play Earthbound. Remember the last time you played Earthbound? Yeah, maybe because the person we were playing it with is, like, dumb. Was Dead. I remember that. You almost got hit. Yeah, well, I'm a pro gamer. Are you gonna start the timer? M L G. Oh, sorry. Yeah, M -L -G. guys, oh, we've been here the entire time. I just, I'm dumb. M L G. M L G. Well, I mean, you know how many people I had to, like, turn down last week alone because they wanted me in their, like, their squads? In their live streams. It's yeah, like, and it's just, come on, guys. Like, I get those messages. I can't. I can't be that. Because I'm Marky's, like, inbox guy. Yeah. I get every single message. Everyone. Just... Every single one. So, like, come on, guys. How desperate are you? I mean, guys, you just can't do that. It's just messed up. Can't send in messages about. Call of Duty and how he wrecked you and stuff. It's like, come on. Matthew, did you get those messages? Man, I forgot what that was. I got one message one time that was the most screwed up message I've ever gotten in my life. What do you mean? And I was like, that's fucked up. What? I was like, all we did was play a video game and you're... Oh, man, I forgot what he said. It was like atrocious though. I was like, he's all like, I'm gonna find you and kill you. <laughs> And I'm all like, what do you do? Because I killed you in a video game? That's a little harsh. Yeah, no. Don't openly threaten someone online about that as a joke. Because you could actually get in a lot of trouble for that. And be put in prison for an open threat. It was ridiculous. Just saying. So like, I'm going to find where you live and kill you. And I'm all like... It's like when someone said openly that they're going to hack you. Because obviously you're going to do something to my PC. Oh, yeah. You're going to steal information. So, yes, I could get you in trouble for that. I was... You openly told me that you <laughs> are going to hack me. <laughs> That's like openly saying, like, I'm going to murder that guy next week. And then he dies and it's all like, I didn't do it, though. <laughs> and it's all like, but do we trust you? You can't say that. I'm just saying. You cannot Anyway, say that. I killed him in Dark Souls PvP, and then he sent me a message saying he was gonna find and kill me. <laughs> and I was like, that was two years ago, by the way. Uh, he's having a very difficult time finding me. Uh, 
Yeah, it's actually pretty funny though. Guys, come on. Like, seriously, just don't be an asshole. Like, seriously, it's a video game. Like, you have to tell people that on Dota all the time. Like, people be like, you fucking, you lost this to the game, you bitch. And it's all like, dude, it's a game. Like, how long do you go to prison for killing someone? Uh, that depends. It can be life. Oh, look at that. <laughs> well, the scary okay. thing, the scary thing about like online like things like that is that s sometimes they don't get handled correctly. Eh. Like I'm sure you. Oh. Whoa. Oh, come on. Okay. Yeah, but sometimes they don't get handled correctly, and it's scary because like. How are we supposed to track, like, I mean, there's ways of tracking the guy, but it's like, I mean, you've already, like, you've watched things on that, like, people getting threatened and then the, like, people, cops being all like, yeah, we can't help you with that. As well, if you don't have their name, then. Exactly. Gotta if, pass uh, up the deal. If you can't physically see him, it's only on the internet, uh, I wouldn't really worry about it. Honestly, like if that. you're stupid enough to do something to someone just to get back at them, to go to prison for that long, yeah, that's that is get, not worth it. That's what you get for killing me in Call of Duty, you scrub. That's not worth it. I'm gonna murder you in your sleep. Well, someone actually did that. No. Yes, they did. That's fucked. Someone actually did that. How wait, wait, wait. What are we doing the context in? Was it actually Call of Duty? Or no, was it? it was Call of Duty. No. It was it was some video not. game, bro. Someone actually did it, and it was fudged up. No one fudging deserves that just because you're fudging angry. <laughs> you have to be a fudging. Oh, no baby. one deserves to be murdered. Yeah, you're right. Well, I mean, unless unless you've murdered someone, I mean, then I mean, I guess it's like fair that you get murdered. What? Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what? Like, yeah. Technically, <laughs> it's pretty much just like asking for it. Like, oh man, I had so much. Ugh, I'm gonna talk about King's Quest right now because I had so much fun playing it. I played the first three King's Quest remastered. You can download them for free. I didn't steal them. <laughs> there's a, there's a people who remade the games and they're free because Sierra let them. By the way, Activision, go fuck yourself. Um. <laughs> So like I beat the all three of the games and then I was like there's a part in it because we were talking about like because we were just talking about the thing and there's a dwarf right and he steals like some little girl's food and then he's all like <laughs> he uh you find him and you steal the food and he's all like you get stuck on a bridge because he cuts the thing and he's all like I'm not gonna let you leave and then you throw the stuff to the other side people will know what I'm talking about if you played it but and then he's all like. I had to get payback for you for stealing my food the other day. And then I was all like, but, I, but you stole it first. And then he's all like, that does two wrongs don't make it right. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love that. Guys, play King's Quest. Support the people who made those remakes. Because they did a fantastic job, and they deserve it. AGD, I think it's AGDI Interactive. It's AGD Interactive. <sighs> Go support them. They're good people. I think they're making a video game. That's like King's Quest. And Activision, honestly, like, seriously, go fuck yourself. Like, I'm not joking. Actually, pretty much every... Who takes a fan project down like that? Pretty much every, uh, game. Of course, I read that online. I don't know if that's true or not, so I could be telling Activision to go fuck itself. But it kind of sounds like Activision and a lot of big companies. Except, uh, every... A gaming company, except uh, we should probably end it here. Actually, from soft, the thing. Uh, and Ooh, and uh, the people that make Metal Gear that made Metal Gear Ryzen, fudge every other company <laughs> besides them. Besides from soft and platinum. Yeah. Dose. Why those? Looking at you, Ubisoft. I mean, come on. Who likes Ubisoft? Welcome to our amazing play. thing, you you play. And then it's all like, uh, of course EA had to get at it, and they were all like, 
We have events. Hey, at least EA doesn't get worst company of the year anymore. I'm pretty sure U- Ubisoft does. I keep on wanting to call it Ubisoft. Ubisoft, I believe they get worst company of the year every year now. Anybody that does that is a fudge face. Who gives someone a worse thing this no, year? No, it pisses me off because the, the people working You have on- to have some fudging balls to be all like, you're the worst of this this year. To not get punched in the face. What? That is insane. Walk up to somebody and you're like, you were the worst company can, this you year. Think they you were the worst that. actor this year. Game sh- it's a game sh- It's an award thing. Do you sign up for it? Oh, okay, so you're telling me Ubisoft you getting worse. Ga- yes! Do you sign up for it? Yes! Okay. Of course! Can't, okay. Can't well, do I don't do think that. you sign up for it. I think it's just automatic rewards. Let's be honest, Ubisoft getting worst game company of the year, honestly. Seriously, I'm not mad about that. Mm, I still dumb. find it bull. Anyway, I'm just I think it's stupid that the fans who were remaking one of the King's Quest and were given permission by Sierra after Sierra like obviously went out of business because they ran out of money or whatever. Well, mostly because they ran out of money. And they were almost done with it and then Activision shut them down. Don't don't tell someone, yeah, okay, we're fine with you making a game and then last minute when they're almost done and about to release it. Shut them down. That's fucked up. Anyway, guys, we'll see you guys next time on uh, Resident Evil. Panda's near the mic.